Okay, this is the episode two of the Scottish Independence Movement. I think I'm going to call it uh, Scotland the Brave. I think it sounds like a cool name, right? Scotland the Brave. Okay, so that's going to be the title of this. I just thought of that. Uh, actually, I kind of had that in my head earlier, but I forgot. I just remembered. So, um, personally, our budget. Back to the budget here. Where's the budget? There's the budget. Okay. We got $1.28 million. I should launch a fundraising campaign. I think this is always a good idea, right? But... Uh, no, it's not. Look at how much money that costs. That is not a good idea. We are not going to do that. I'm going to have to meet with the billionaire, maybe. Maybe get them. i got to promise the billionaire something. Okay. Time to go billionaire. Same action. Alright, this is a request for a secession referendum for, in for independence in your region. That's going to be the thing that I have to do. And I think I need... I'm probably going to have to buddy up with political parties. So, I don't know. Strategies. Maybe buddy up with a bunch of groups. Win a whole bunch of seats in Parliament. And try to win the vote. Uh, this would probably not work right off the bat, I, I doubt. Hold a secession referendum. Uh, holding a secession referendum allows people to decide whether or not they want their region to become an independent state. Hmm. I don't see this. I don't remember seeing this in the Syrian campaign. Um, the authorities can refuse a request for such a referendum. If the people vote in favor, then the region will become a state, and power will be handed over to the leader of the pro-independence group. Uh, I gotta, if I confirm, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that just yet. Whoa, look at all these. No, I can criticize. I was going to encourage protests in the media. Nope, nothing there. I've never seen anything there. being enacted right now. They can all protest in action. I don't know what action. That's the thing. They never tell you what action to protest. You don't have that option. When I do it myself, I think I do have the option, right? Look at that. Scotland for Edinburgh. Okay. No elections until 2020. Congressional elections in 2020. That is a ways off. That's about four years off. Here's a good graph for the, for the breakdown. Those groups do not like this. Four point. This is the distribution of votes at Parliament in elections of 2015. Uh, I gotta go in here. This is where. This group, and this group. That's not enough to beat out the uh, United Republic. So, in if I'm going to play a long game, I'm going to want to uh, try to take over some more seats from them. That would be a long game. A shorter game. Probably be some sort of uh, rebellion movement. And then I think I'd have to run the party illegally to do that. I don't think I'm going to make that call just yet. Maybe I'll save that until after the Congress. Alright, so let me go into my. Uh, I have to come up with a strategy on promises here. And um, I do want to make a lot of promises to the unions. We're gonna go ahead and oh, I do want to meet up with the billionaire too. Where is my billionaire? There's a businessman, and I'm gonna want the left-wing billionaire because I am much more liberal. We'll meet up with him on Monday, and uh, the other move is gonna be to go after the union leaders. I'm gonna promise.
them all the same thing, I think. It's gonna be big union week here. All these big unions. I am gonna promise them all. I think I'm gonna promise them all pension. Something with the pension. I'm gonna boost up the pension. And uh, that will be a promise that I could give the elderly as well. So that's going to be all the same promises right there. And let's even throw in that elderly group. Because I might, senior citizen group, I might as well make a promise to them as well. And then I'll wait to see what happens. Maybe I'll criticize the government on something. Alright, so let's actually start this clock here. There we go. Actually start the clock here. And we'll make it fast. Whoa, there goes that train. Look at it go. Alright. Clock's ticking. And uh, I got some appointments coming up. There's a ship headed out of port. That looks pretty cool. It's a freighter. And a train. Business is business. Things are flowing in Scotland. speed this up until I get the newspaper. The newspaper will tell me a little bit more about what is actually happening here. Oh, we got a meeting. Whoa, slow down. Protestant leader, here we go. Alright, coffee to sure. the priest. Dark and strong, strong please. Obviously he likes it. Maybe I should just make a note of that. Protestant coffee. Yep, I'm gonna make a note of that. Um, spiritually speaking, your religion has always been a great inspiration to me. It's a feeling that honors you. Now, can I make you a promise? Yes. And my promise is going to be taxation. We are going to tax alcohol consumption. That's big. See if he goes for this one percent increase in liquor tax. It's a little disappointing. Oh man, really? I was expecting something else. I gotta boost that I up like five percent or something like that. Oh bummer. Bummer. My thoughts will be with you, that you may find light in the dark corridors of power. Well, at least he's praying for me. All right, let's get out of there. Bummer. I wanted to do more. I'm going to offer 5%. We're going to take that liquor tax all the way up to 5%. Because you know what I'm going to do? The liquor could pay for the pension increase. Right? It's not like I'm actually going to have to follow through on these promises. Alright, here's the newspaper. First newspaper. Ooh, this looks cool. The Watcher. Slovakia elections. Belize. Elections. All right, here we go. Social Labor Union. Rebels against Social Security contributions. The level of Social Security safety contribution is too high compared to the employers. Aha! That's the one I want to drop. All right, that's what we're making of it. We're gonna say maybe I should meet with this guy too. We're gonna say. That employer donation contributions need to go up to pay for Social Security. I like it. Alright, popularity rating is at a delivery point. Here we go. Fluffing billionaire. I have some champagne there, buddy. That's what we call entertaining. Okay, you are radiant. You're not bad yourself. This guy might be a homosexual. Or no, I'm a woman. Ha! I didn't know that. Alright, um... You're definitely the richest, most generous. It's very kind of you. I'm really pleased to hear it. Okay. Now we're going to make him a promise. And the promise is going to be... 
I think the same promise that I am going to make the consumer agency. And that promise is going to be a taxation promise. And we're going to drop sales tax by 1%. You got to like that, right, buddy? Huh. That's not to be turned down. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, we are friends. And will you fund the party? Yes, it's a good idea. Bam! Big win there. All right, we got some money coming our way. And the meeting. Okay, I forgot I was a woman. Ha! Fenella Ferguson. Fenella? That's an interesting name. Okay, uh, popularity rating for this guy who is the leader. Prime Minister. Is that an equilibrium? Alright. I think that's about it as far as information goes. And we got a couple more meetings coming up. I gotta meet with the Protestant guy again. That's horrible. Alright, let's go ahead and let's keep track of these things here. My one promise has been to cut sales tax. That's going to the billionaire. We're going to go ahead and promise that to the uh, consumer union as well. Not union. Consumer association. Consumer rights. I'll meet with you. I already made a promise. Made a promise. I can make to you. We've got meetings all week. Look at this. Very busy. Busy, busy, busy. Will it work? Or should I start a revolution? What do you guys think? Post in the comments, please. Let me know. I think I'm going to take one more meeting. And we'll end this episode after the next meeting. Call entertaining. There we go. You are radiant. I owe it to myself to make an effort when I Here come I am see flirting you. with all these union leaders. This is awkward for me. Um, asking to become your lover. I am not going to do that. Let's see. Make a promise. And let's see here. What promise did I want to make? Oh, right. Player contributions. Lawyer contributions, we're gonna up that. Fifteen percent, right? You gotta like that. I'm sorry, but we still disagree on some points. Oh man, really? Okay, I don't know what to do there. Let's get out of here. Well that's not gonna work. Yikes. that work. I gotta find something else for these labor guys. Huh. That's not to be turned down. What? You're radiant. You're not bad yourself. <laughs> Man. Okay. Let's see here. Promise. What is this? I gotta find a better promise. Work? Legislation? No, no, no. I don't know. I can't believe that wasn't enough. Let's make it uh, 3%. Bump up. I'm sorry, but we still disagree on some points. Wow. I gotta find something else for the uh, 
I was thinking minimum wage might be the other one. Let's try minimum wage. Who is this? Proletariat? Alright, champagne for you. I'd be happy to. That's what we call entertaining. Flirt with the guy. I owe it to myself to make an effort when I come to see you. At least he's, at least he's better than the bald guy. <laughs> um... Unions. No, 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 no. Regulate right to strike. Authorized. What if I do that? I think I'm going to do that. Let's try this. Doesn't cost anything. Huh. That's not to be turned down. Nice. Thank you. Authorize the right to strike. Okay. I have to promise that to the other union leaders. Alright, I'll see you later. Who's this? Great. The billionaire has transferred money to the party's account. Very good. Very good. Okay, this would probably be a good time to end the episode on YouTube. Live streaming, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep going. So feel free to keep watching.